All right, Brennan Taylor, True School Sports. I'm here with Bilal Lagoon. How you doing, Bilal? I'm good, man. Good, good. It's good to meet you. Um, you know, we're in the Ali gym. Today is actually the Ali funeral. Uh, what does Muhammad Ali mean to you as a fighter? He's everything in boxing, man. He's, he's the one who made boxing so great. So you know, he has a big name in boxing. Yeah. Is there any moment that, or any moment, or anything about Muhammad Ali that sticks out to you more so than anything else? He's just, just the motivation, and that's a lot. Yeah. Um. Do you, do you have a favorite Ali fight? Do you have a favorite like fight of his that, that you've yeah, watched? I, I like Joe Frazier. Uh, the, uh, the second. Second fight. Yeah. Was that Philip? Was that one the thriller Manila? The second one? Uh, I think it's the second. Yeah, second one, right? Yeah, it's a great yeah, fight. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, man, Ali, you know, rest in peace to him. Yeah. Tough it's stuff. a bad day in uh, boxing history. It's almost like we, we lost a huge part of boxing. Yeah, it's almost like someone in your family member died. <laughs> yeah. But uh, about you, you, know, you were the, tell people about, about yourself, you were a cruiserweight? I was a cruiserweight, I was European cruiserweight champion. Um, one time, second time I had a draw, but not deserved, but that happens in boxing, so. Now I go to light heavyweight and I'm fighting for WBC Francophone. If I win, I get I come in the top 15 WBC ranking. So little by little I get to the top. Little by little. All right. Now, um, what about your amateur background? How, 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 Not a lot of fight. Belgium is small and they they don't have a lot of fights. They have like 50 amateur fights, mm -hmm. like five loss, 45 wins. Okay, but I wish I had more. But Belgium is so small. Yeah. They don't have enough fighters. Yeah, and you are from Belgium. I forgot to mention that earlier. Yeah. Uh, the Belgian boxing scene. There isn't much of a boxing scene over there, is there? No, we have good fighters, but they don't do a lot with the fighters over there in Belgium. You know? It's not. They don't like. But it's not like America. America, they like fighting. They like UFC, the boxing. Belgium, they don't like. They don't like. They yeah. They like soccer, tennis. Okay. So when you were in Belgium, being that like if the sport isn't as popular over there, when you told like uh, your mom or your family, you know, that you're gonna be a boxer, what did, what did they say to that? In the beginning, they didn't like it, but now they're accepting because I'm not, you know, they can't take away from what I like. Yeah. So they like it and they accept it. Yeah, but they don't go ahead. They don't have any problems with it. Okay. How long have you been here in the states? For one year. One year. year and a half. You, you like you like you like it so far? I love it. Love it. What's the biggest difference between uh, here and uh, Belgium, you would say? Everything, everything changes, especially the weather, the weather, the people, everything. Training, especially for training, I love it, man. This is the best gym over here, the history gym, the best. Well, what separates from all the other gyms that you've been to? Just everything, man. It's just the motivation, the coach, uh, you know, the energy in the gym, it's really, really good. Yeah, I like it. It's my second time being here. It's a good environment. It's great. Uh, for those of you who haven't seen, for people who haven't seen you fight before, could you describe yourself as a boxer and your style? They, they will see me in the future. Okay. I'm not going to tell too much about them. They, they will hear about me in the future. And they will, I can tell you, they're going to enjoy it. They're going to love it. All right. Any message to the boxing world? Uh, they just... Be on the lookout. Yeah. All right. <laughs> By Lau Lagoon. Be on the lookout for him. He's coming.